Hello everyone, my name is Stanley St. Rose, and today we're going to be talking about the epic on the nature of things by Lucretius. Now before I move this topic, please remember to leave a like, subscribe, and or comment so that the channel can continue to grow. So, the epic on the nature of things by Lucretius, it's pretty much a poem by Lucretius based on reality. Um, you know, these are several books um, where he talks about everything in reality. So he talks about how the soul is made out of atoms. Uh, he talks about how gods exist, but the gods are like at the edge of the universe and they don't interfere with human life. Uh, this poem is very vivid, very articulate, very, um, you know, it shows you, it, it describes different things and it argues different things about reality, our lives. Um, it's not really focused on the afterlife or gods or religion. Um, so they're more of a, um, these ideas that Lucretius publishes within, with on, you know, on the epic of things, it's all about reality, our lives, the world, the universe, um, you know, how we should avoid, um, suffering, avoid pain and pursue happiness and the things that makes us happy. Which is actually, honestly, honestly, um, it's it's interesting because how can you avoid pain? Pain is everywhere. Um, so that's something worth thinking about. Um, but yeah, the, the whole work is about the earth, how the earth was formed, how everything is made out of atoms, the soul, the purpose of life, why we exist, uh, his belief that gods exist, but they don't affect us. Uh, and um, why things happen. You know, he believes in chance. He believes in reality. He believes that we should pursue happiness and joy and not pain. Um, these are the, the ultimate ideas of um, on the epic of things by Lucretius. It's not focusing on connecting to the celestial, the spiritual, uh, or the afterlife. or worshiping some type of God or anything. It's pretty much... Hey, reality is what it is. Live your life to the best. Then you die and your atoms become some part of the universe. So don't worry about the wrath of the gods or anything like that. Live your life to the fullest and enjoy your life. So very interesting thinking. This is a thinking that is everywhere in the earth today. Um, some people don't believe in gods and think that the universe came from nothing. And so this is not... This is a, a belief that exists to this day. But that's pretty much what you get on, on this writing on the Epic of Things by Lucretius. Please remember to leave a like, subscribe, and or comment so that the channel can continue to grow. Um, all right. I'll see you guys in the next one.